It's Taran Chum from Outsourcing Live. Now you see anything different? I'm in black and white. How's that for special effects for you? I thought I'd just give this a, a little change around just to see what it's like. If you like it, let me know. If you don't, you know, that's cool. I just wanted to play around with this camera because the fact is, is that I've been trying so many new things in the last few months and I finally have found something that I really like and has been working really well. Now, in this video, I'm going to share with you very, very shortly a little tip that I've been, I've been playing around with. And the thing is, is that a lot of people have been asking me, how do I get this little blurry background in a lot of my videos and get the focal point on just me? And it looks very professional and it looks very, very nice as well too. And I, that's been a lot of the compliments I've been getting from you and also a lot of my loyal followers and viewers. So firstly, thank you very much for that. Now. I'll give you a very little tip and sneak just to show you exactly what it is. It's something to do with the lens. But I won't, I won't tell you right now because I want to share with you how I got to that because it did take me a lot of trials and, and testing and all that kind of stuff. And I wanted to let you know how it does work because the thing is, is there's no point having it set up and not understanding how to get there because I wish I knew this when I first started. Going back a few months ago, I was contemplating about upgrading to another camera and I'd been using the Kodak ZI8 for quite some time and you've seen a lot of my videos where everything's in high definition and the quality is pretty good. It's just that you don't have that nice blurry background effect and also focus on the camera. And also too, I required a lot of extra equipment such as lighting and also making sure that I have the right angles here and there to make sure that the camera captures it correctly. Whereas this particular camera that I'm currently using now, which is the Canon T3i, I don't really need to do anything. I don't even have lighting on my face at this point in time. Everything's used by natural light and the adjustment of the camera. And that's the powerful thing about getting an SLR camera like the Canon T3i. No matter what camera you go for, just make sure it does have a proper video function like this one. And the reason why I recommend the Canon T3i, which is in another video that I talked about previously, is it's got this nice little flip LCD screen that comes on the back. Instead of having to sort of guesswork where you're sitting, you can flip this camera around, flip the LCD screen around and watch yourself talk so that way you can have that right focal. Right now I'm talking to it and I can see myself talk, which is a bit bizarre. But anyway, <laughs> all right, so that's basically where I led to and I had to ask around because I had absolutely no idea. I was like thinking, I thought it was something to do with um, the camera itself, the settings and all that and after a while I thought, oh, just ask a few people around. And unfortunately, not everyone was able to tell me exactly what to do, so I had to figure it out myself. In the end, uh, one person just said to me, get a different lens, and that, that does the trick. So the whole concept is if you have a Canon SLR camera or any type of camera, all you need to do is buy a lens with a small aperture. And what that means by an aperture is basically the whole size of your lens. And the smaller the whole size, the more it focuses on your point, which is my face and let everything else blur in the background. And that's to do with what we call the term aperture. I won't go into too much detail about it, but I'll put an article linked to it to explain what aperture is. And essentially what I've done is I purchased this Canon uh, 50 mm 50 mm lens, which is a fixed lens, just to be specific, a fixed lens. And it's a f1.8, which is the aperture size. And what you want to do is to get the smallest aperture. Now, the smaller the aperture, the more expensive it becomes and it jumps up dramatically in price from 1.8 down to 1.4. And the price difference is roughly about $100 for this lens and about $300 for that other lens. Um, you might see just a slight little quality difference. I, I have seen the slight little quality difference, but I, I wasn't interested in paying that extra because I don't think my viewers like yourself would probably even notice. So really, that's, that's how you do it. Just get a separate different lens, make sure you have an SLR camera and a fixed lens makes a difference because then you don't have to worry about um, fixing up the zoom and all that stuff. And an f1.8 is more than sufficient enough to get that nice blur. Currently, you might be wondering what camera lens am I using? I'm just using my standard one, which is a zoom and it's a 3.5. So I don't get as much focal, um, I guess, blur in the background with this particular lens, but I guess you probably won't notice because it's in black and white. Ah, and that's the reason why I did it. And you'll probably also won't notice too much difference if you um, are just watching on video like you are right now. So anyway, that's, that's the little trick. That's the tip on what to do. And if you are interested in doing it, that's all you need to do.
All right, so let me know what your thoughts are. I really um, appreciate all your feedback and I really appreciate any comments because a, a lot of these videos that I create are based on what you ask me. So I create them uh, to answer in most of your questions here. All right, thanks so much for watching. My name is Tyrone Chum from Outsourcing Life and I'll see you inside the next video. Bye for now. Take a minute to check out our website at http colon forward slash forward slash outsourcinglive.com. You'll find step-by-step -step how to videos, tricks, tips, and case studies helping you to outsource your videos. Lastly, don't forget to subscribe to our newsletter for a free video course and special offers.